You fell into my trap. Hey guys, it is Fell Arbor, returned from the beyond the beyond. <laughs> um, been so busy with conventions for fun and conventions for work and work and work and stuff like that, that I just haven't had the chance to come and play and relax. But here I am. So I am going to pick back up with Air and our adventures with Auk as she searches for all of the shrines something about the lady oh i forgot her name i want to call her kiara but that's not it something like that anyway um birds little tiny orange and green oh that's my head birds hey hero jeans playing super nintendo have fun <laughs> anyway um so yeah this is our little flying simulator with some sporadic um puzzles in it and it's supposed to be calm and relaxing which is kind of what we need and i've got cecily here with me right <laughs> Mommy is out with BJ. Shout out to Mr. BJ. Happy birthday. I am belated. Um, I guess it's kind of like an Easter egg because I don't think he watches this sort of playthrough. But if he does, he'll see I said happy birthday. <laughs> and he'll also see me talking shade about him because we used to be a posse in Red Dead Redemption 2 online until he found that it was too boring for him. And so now I'm by myself. <laughs> I will always keep doing that with that button. All right, so I believe, and I did have to watch the last couple of minutes of my playthrough to remind myself, because it's been like, what, a month? I believe we were supposed to be heading southwest to the next um, place. Man, this looks so pretty. Uh, the thing around her reminds me of Amatras in um, Okami. She, uh, Okami, she had like the, the shield thing, so she's kind of got like a some sort of jewelry i guess that's her does she wear that anyway um i did not reinvert my i'm going really slowly but am I, I am headed southwest right let me check on that yeah i must be going the right way because there's nothing over there so ostensibly i will be uncovering this land that i'm right in front of me i'm not flapping so i'm not going faster but um what was i saying something about okami and, uh, oh, I didn't invert my controls. Um, that looks like a shrine or something, right? Maybe it'll say I found something. Hup, hup, <laughs> Twilight Lake. Oh yeah, I did remember that. If you touch something, you immediately transform. I also did find out, and let me get to a place where it'll save it, but um, after the playthrough last time, just I just wanted to see what happened. I flew and then fell? You don't die. Um, it just spawns you back where you last saved or whatever. Oh, I forgot to press the button. Now I'm pushing the wrong button. Okay, water landing. Sweet. Ooh. Anyway, so it is very calm and relaxing. I'm sure there's places where it'll get frustrating where, like, you fail a puzzle and you have to start all over or something. But there is no, at least at this moment, there is no death. There's no, you know, money system. There's no anything we have to worry about except the beautiful artwork and design. Okay, yeah, so the thing that goes around the bird kind of looks like the thing that's hanging on her uh, bottom of her skirt. I might have already pointed that out, I don't remember. <gasps> Somebody broke the statue, it's missing a head. It's a chimera? Oh, it's like a lion. Cool. <gasps> that's a sphinx, uh oh. Can I touch this? Read. My brother strayed to guard the lighthouse, and I volunteered to join him in his duty. I shall guard the land and its animals, yes. <laughs> Even if I do not understand why the priestess wants us to stand guard. Are the gods truly sleeping in this land, and we are to guard them? But why then are they asleep? Can gods even sleep? I think this is just a story for children. The gods are long gone from our world, and their lands now belong to the spirits and the animals. But names stay longer than the memory of a face. So you want to guard them, but you don't want to guard them? But maybe they're like, guard them from what? I could see like, well, maybe the gods should be guarding us. You know, but they're busy. They got things to do, like sleep. <laughs> it's really pretty. I, okay, I might need to reinvert. I don't know. I, don't, I hope I'm not making anybody sick. 
I'm usually pretty good with inverted controls. Go up. Woo! Anything else to explore? What's, what's this? Oops, I'm blowing my mouth. Bubberfly! You're a big bubberfly! Oh, is this like one of those things in niche? I can stand on it and call my friends? Or more like... Oh, I called a sissy. <laughs> okay. Is that a bird? I remember I could take out my lantern and then you can see like the sh shades of the past and they're like praying and stuff. Burb! Oh, burb! Oh, I'm a burb too, you know. $10 says that's where I'm supposed to be going. But there's no money in this game, so I automatically win that bet. And I don't know why I'm headed this way. Turn around. Hello. Oh, <laughs> oh I did. I uh, was also practicing. Thank you. I'll go through these clouds. They look like they're rocks, but I think they're clouds. Yeah. Whee! <laughs> uh, I don't go on too many plane rides, but when I do, I like to sit next to the window so that I can watch flying. If I'd had any superpower, I'd be flying. Ooh. Can I swim? Oh. <laughs> None of the water is more than knee deep so that I can make sure that I don't drown. Ooh. I just wanted to see this. Oh, walk through it. All right, well, it's probably for the best that I'm walking because I'm bad at landing. I guess you could argue I'm also bad at flying, but. All right, so this is, the, is this the thing to the entrance of the temple? Ugh, they're still a little creepy. I'm not wearing some fancy glasses, though. They're walking this way. Somebody built some sandcastles. A to open the temple. Win. Um, as I was loading. I have the sound low so that we won't get like a feedback so I can't really hear the music and the sound effects but when I was I was going back and um trying to remind myself how to play uh the music in this is gorgeous oh. well I could fly but I, or jump because there's no fall damage either but I guess I'll take these somebody took the time to carve out these 10,000 steps oh but anyway yeah it's beautiful this a movie? Or they just wanted to keep me from having to rock. What if I tried to fly? I wonder if it would automatically just turn me back. All right, we're going to cut out this loading because this is taking a long while. We'll be right back. Mm. Saving. Thanks. All right, let's take in the ambiance. Deep. Man, the lighting in this game is so good. I don't want to reload going back where I just came from. Okay, those are the stairs I just came down. I don't want to go back and then like, okay, we're leaving. Yeah, okay, so we'll go the way this told us to. <laughs> All right, does this help me? Yeah. You know, like I, I know that the, we made it. Eventide Sanctuary. Yay, he's so happy. Um, I was gonna say, I know the polygonal, polygonal, <laughs> polygonal. Are you in a polygonal marriage? <laughs> um, polygonal or you know like crudely. You know put together but i like the artistic flair to it but i think also this is more about the storytelling and working on like the lighting and the music and all right so i do whoa <laughs> slightly startling oh look sanctuary yeah they're only creepy because it's like you can see their bones oh that person's got to sort back man i feel you all right so these people were probably coming to see the we will be safe here. I come in here. I don't know what their the Great Divide, right, or something like. There's a major earthquake. Whoa. Okay. Got some water. I think I found that you can't fly in here, right? Yeah, that would be cheating. <laughs> okay, the sun and the moon. Sharoonies. Like, even, like, when you think about it in our real world, like, the time that it took to hand-carve all this stuff and make it... Wait. Okay, so 
So this guy seems to be telling me to go up this way. <gasps> Climbing. Yeah, that's probably how I'd have to do it. Oh, I'm floating. <laughs> Collision detection. But anyway, yeah, like... Even with modern machinery, it's still amazing what we can build. But when you think about when, you know, no, like... Alright, granted, they probably had different pulley systems and things, and we've probably forgotten a lot of the ancient technology they had. But still, to carve out pieces of stone, either by hand or machine, still pretty cool. I'm just exploring, just in case there's more lore around here. Game designers let you uh, come over here, so I might as well. Hey, engineer number four four five, when you were carving this stone, I stepped on it. I even jumped up here because I can. Right. Okay, but I can read this right. The twilight guardian opened her eyes at the light of sun and moon shining together. Twilight. She sat down and calmly took both in her sky hands, bringing balance to light and shadow. With her right hand, she releases the sun to let people back from the dream. Whoa, that's kind of cool. With her left, she flings the moon into the night sky so that people may dream at all. I like that. I really like a, I like words and how things move like to let people back from the dream. She is the heartbeat of the seasons, at the center of the world, the breath of life and order. She and I be friends. I like order. I like reading. Oh uh, yeah, but anyway, that was really poetic. I'm not, not being facetious. Let people back from the dream. Never heard morning quite. It's like, awake from your tiny death. <laughs> I'm assuming, okay. I, the dust was making me think that it was the sky, but no, the sky is what you're seeing. The cow spots. <laughs> okay. Serious business. Fudder by. Banner. So was that made that way or did that fall and then the banner just happened to land there? <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Are there speed runs of this game? <laughs> I would lose because I can't even fly the right way. Alright. Okay. Trees and things are taking back. Wow, they made tents in here. So yeah, so this is a sanctuary from them leaving. There aren't like, is there something evil here, right? Can I get up there? Or is it just more? Maybe I go up there in a second. There's more houses up there. Bridge. These these little glyphs that are glowing. I wonder what. I want to keep that on. I wonder what they're about, though. Like those, the large spots? These little... Oh, that's where people are. What are you doing? I mean, blowing to stoke the fire. What's your friend doing? Whoops, I jumped. I forgot I couldn't talk to them, I guess. Okay. Keep going up. I think I think, see something I can read. Okay, so I don't think I can get back over there. That was just, like, showing you, like, the ancients lived here for a while. Let's read this. Whoa. Oh, he's got. Oh, they're having a dance. Aww. Man, they're doing like the. The Watusi. Or is he pulling her up to come dance? But. <laughs> so they're like. Doing some swing dancing. That guy's getting jiggy. Oh. Uh, he's doing that sign. So if you need to punch someone, please. Or smack someone for doing the okay sign. <laughs> Wasn't that thing a few years ago? Oh, they look like kids. Alright, examine. Man has paws that cannot run, but chases longingly the sun. Man has wings that cannot fly, but he will always seek the sky. Man has eye. Man has eyes that cannot see, but watch eternity. Man is lost unknowingly in danger to his own mind, always a stranger. I don't really like the lyrics to your song, but I guess I kind of see Irony of being a human. Barrels. More barrels. Giant bush. Okay. 
I think that... Oh, I see something over there. Is that poem going to come back to uh, be something? Divergent paths. It's locked. Okay. This is the moon side. Not a whole lot to see. Oh, okay, so it wraps around, right? I wish I could turn into that fox guy and, like, run a little faster. <laughs> she runs pretty quickly, but, you know. Alright, so that's just a wrap around. So over here... Looks like the way I'm probably supposed to go. Let's see what's up here. Ooh, I run fast upstairs. Burp! Oh, burp. oh, is this a dead person? Is that one of the gods? Another song? Oh, read part one. I am Kara. That's her name. Not Kiara. I was close. I am Kara of the Thunder Islands. I had a strange dream that I will record here so that others may perhaps understand its meaning as I did. I had come to study the holy carvings in the lighthouse in the land of gods, trying to understand our heritage. As I reached out to touch some of the runes, it suddenly felt as a warm hand passed over my eyes and I fell asleep on the sacred stone. In my dream, it seemed to me that the stone beneath me glowed from within, forming a staircase up into the starry sky. Far away on these steps, a golden light grew and drew close. Stars flew from the sky and became someone who had the shape of music and was gentle and sad. Cool story, bro. Part two. The god spoke to me not in words, but in memories and feelings. He warned me of a terrible greed from beyond, a void in the hearts of men. As he showed it to me, I felt it stir and come between us, darkening the golden steps like a storm cloud, cold as eternity. Terrified, I cried out at the pull of this dark void, and I woke. I could not speak for three days, but I set out to the ancient temples immediately. If what I have seen is true, the gods are alive, and they need our help as we need theirs. Symbiosis. Oh, no, wouldn't even let me jump. <laughs> okay, so now that I've read that, I will come back over here. All right, so... Uh... Something's keeping us from the gods, which will keep us from our greatness. All right, what do you do? This box. Use it. Okay. And up the bottom one. Okay. A little platforming here. All right, that's fine. I'm assuming I need to keep up my... Whoa. Of course, I think it... Did this wrap around? Was the one I needed to get down there? No. Okay. It was a dead end, so you did it. This way. There's one. That's okay, though. Here's one. Okay, so is this just... Parkour? Use... These don't have to be done in any kind of order. <laughs> now I have to use my big brain. How do I get over there? Right, not from here. Let's keep exploring. Let's go get that one. Whoa, I almost fell in the gap. Whoa. There's a person down there. Uh, okay, let's do this one. There's one. I'd still be missing one. I've right, got person telling me where it is. Oh gosh. Hello? That didn't look like a comfortable sleeping position, sir. Why did they put that guy there? Maybe to teach you not to fall. Okay. So I was I didn't actually come over this way, so I just figured that out. Okay. 
So my little parkouring. Not missing anything, right? Okay. Okay. Oh. oh no, that's so don't fall again, please. Whew. That's so sad. Why is that in here? This one. Is it, is it still light it up in the right way? How do I get to that one? In my big brain, using my big brain. It's over here. Oh, can't stand on that. Did I miss like a staircase? Oh, maybe I could push this thing? Huh, did I jump off that? Oh, can I climb this? Hmm. Alright, let's use our brains here. There's like a tunnel or a, something right there. See that hole? Alright, just because I'm over here, let me go all the way up to the door and maybe it'll be like, nope, you can't come in. Just in case. Whoops. <laughs> uh oh, am I stuck in here? Alright. So I think that hole has something to do. Yeah. Alright, better vantage point. Oh, so could I have just kept going around the circle? Maybe I'm being silly. I was seeing through to beyond the beyond. All right. All right. Maybe I gave up too soon. Maybe I just jumped from where the bridge was. Maybe it's not as complicated as I was thinking it is. Okay. I think that's what you're supposed to do. I just jumped too soon. I'm not going to complain if this is an easy-ish puzzle, because um, it's not really a... <gasps> Alright, just a second. I'll come back when I'm back up there. Okay. So I think I do jump there, but let's be smart and jump from here. There we go. Alright, so it wasn't that complicated of a thing. I guess I don't have to keep my light out. Okay, let's not fall again, because that wastes so much time. <laughs> Controls are pretty good in the game, but I don't, it's not really made to be like a precision jumping type of, you know. You can't really move in midair, which makes sense. I don't think humans can actually move in midair like that. Okay, there we go. So what's the smartest way back? I was interested in this thing, though. Whoops, never mind. <laughs> I guess that's just there for decor. I'm really still sad about that person that fell. Man, why'd you put that in here? I thought this was a sanctuary. I didn't think there was death. Lots of big beams. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Oh man, that would have sucked. There's not death, but there is frustration. Alright, any reason I shouldn't touch this thing? Lower the drawbridge. Thank you. Oh, so there's gotta be one on the other side, huh? I see. I heard a cat. Oh, it's my cat. <laughs> Thought it was in the game. Okay, okay. I got the sun and I know how to turn on the moon. But there was no door. Does it open now? Hmm. What did I miss? Oh. Nope. <laughs> what am I missing? Is 
This was over here before. Are you in here? Okay. Alright. Okay. Um, yeah. So wouldn't the door be this one? Twisting. Alright, let's go back up here because there's nowhere else to go. Is part one still? Okay. Um. Maybe I'm being silly. But I don't see where I'm supposed to go. make that jump so I do have to make that bridge over there go down but how do I get over there what am I missing this is the same thing right yeah. storm clouds Alright, um... Did I put my lantern away? I don't know why that would be a thing, but... It's pretty dark in here. <laughs> Do you see the way to go? <laughs> so backtrack a little, I guess. Maybe there's an alternate way up. Woo! Hello. Hello. What you looking at? Just everything. Things are floating, aren't they? No, that must be where I'm supposed to be going, right? Because that's where I just came down from. This is a door too, but it looks closed as well. Yes. Hmm. Oh, can I walk up this thing? Ooh. Am I supposed to walk up this thing? Just because you can doesn't mean you should. No, I can't go any higher. Um. Now I've forgotten where I've come from. <laughs> like, I know where I'm going, but have I already been over here? That cat is meowing a lot. I'm not, like, collecting things, so... So some of the oh oh <laughs> I found a twist. It's our little Easter eggs. <laughs> oh, so you could have climbed up this thing. Um, I just I don't know because there's not like I haven't collected enough foggy bottoms and you know. All right, that is where I came from. So I came up this way and I was like, wow, this is really cool. Found them having a tryst over there. Saw that guy sitting up there. I don't know if I can get up there. I was just over up there. Hmm. Well, I might need to just stop and then maybe I can just kind of like run around on my own. Um, all right, let me just go back in here. The only thing that of question to me is that weird like square? You know what I was looking at? 
But I don't know why that would have anything to do with anything. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't look like it's not going to shoot me out. I think it's just, like, this root. Right? Whew. My cat is sad. Yeah, it looks like it's just there. Uh, it's just the artwork. But just in case... Oh, is this a... Oh, no. <laughs> I thought it was a crack. I could go in. Um... Here, so the bridge is broken. Yeah, I don't see a way I can get to that edge. So I did that. Where is that root thing? Is it on the other side? It's over here. Tree. Yeah, there it is. But I don't think it is anything. Uh, whew, almost fell in with that guy who fell down and died. Um, alright, well... Hmm. I like when games leave it up to you to figure out what's going on. But at the same time, I are to dumb. So... Let me come back through here one more time. Since the giant door I opened. Jumping over here. Let's climb these. No. Okay here. I don't think I'm supposed to go down there, right? Because that just brings me back to where I just was. So I came through here and I opened this. Now there's a sunshine. Right. Nothing else to read. Then I came down here. Okay, well, um, I don't want to waste a whole bunch of time just me running around in circles. I will continue to run around in circles, and when I find where I'm supposed to be going, I will go, oh, and then come back. Um, in the meantime, this will have posted, and as I'm running around, do you see where I'm supposed to go? <laughs> or if you've played this, you know, like, maybe hit me in the right direction. I like to figure out puzzles, but can't really do the puzzle if I don't know where I'm going. And I don't think that was the end of it, because last time we finished one of these, um, do you guys talk to me? No. Um, last time we finished these, it gave me like a really clear sign that I was done, and then I talked to that fox guy. So, all right. Well, thank you for joining me again for air. I'm hoping you're enjoying it. It is a more peaceful, relaxed kind of playthrough with beautiful music and imagery. Um, I'm going to keep playing it. I hope that I'll be a little bit more regular now that we're into June and past all the busy time and coming into summer for some more relaxation. So please leave any comments you'd like below. Have you played this? Do you think you want to play this? Um, help me <laughs> figure out where I'm supposed to be going. <laughs> and again, thanks for joining me and I will pick this up after the drop. Okay.